All right. Um, first part of this series, we're going to look on basic uh, topics in algebra. Is the idea of the integers. Um, we'll put sort of a line here. The integers are uh, sort of what set us up to understand negative numbers. So, whenever you're learning to count, you count like um, what's called the natural numbers, which is um, one, two, three, four, and so on. Um, I think it was the Persians added zero, and if you add zero to the natural numbers, you get shit. Whole numbers, which is zero, one, two, three, four. And uh, so on. Now, if you take the opposite of the whole numbers, then you get um, what are called negative numbers, which are um, like negative one, negative two, negative three. So, this is what sets us up to have the integers um, be like negative three, negative two, negative one, zero, one, two, three, and so on. Uh, afterwards. Uh, this is how we create the integers and so now we have um, you know a way to deal with uh, numbers lower than zero so <clears throat> if we have a addition of integers let's say um, we would s let's go back Okay, well, addition of integers, um, you start with, say, you know, if you had 3 plus 4, that's 7. Um, likewise, you have negative 3 plus negative 4, that's negative 7. Um, if the signs are the same, you just uh, add them together. Okay, if the signs are different of the two numbers you're adding, let's say negative 5 and uh, plus 8, then you have to think of it as... Uh, sort of two opposing sides. And I want to do sort of an illustration here. Imagine we have um, five negative signs and three plus signs. Well, the amount, you know, you have three more plus signs. So it's uh, going to be positive three. Um, intuitively, you just take um, the, you know, it's be the difference between eight and five which is 3. So let's say um, 7 plus negative uh, 9. Okay, well, um, negative 9 is the biggest number of the two that we're adding together. You know, we have, well, we have either 9 or 7. 9 is the bigger, so our answer is going to be negative. Um, you see that here in this problem before, the uh, bigger of the two numbers, you know, just looking at the 5 and the 8, the bigger number was the 8, so we know our answer is going to be positive. Here, the bigger number is the 9, so our answer is going to be negative. Finally, we take the difference. It's 9 minus 7, and that gives us um, you know, the number part of our answer. So let's back up and do a couple more examples. Let's say we have 395 plus negative... Uh, Uh, we'll say plus negative um, 542. Okay, well first you need to see what the sign is going to be. So you check to see which number is biggest. Well, 542 is the biggest number, and its sign is negative, so we're going to be negative. Next, we just subtract the two numbers. So say 542 minus 395. That gives us 147. So I have 147. Our answer would be negative 147. Uh, we'll do one more, and we're going to go to uh, subtraction. I'm just going to type some random numbers. We'll say this plus, uh, well, I end up being about the same number. We'll say uh, these two numbers. It's big numbers, but don't panic. Same thing. Okay, which number is biggest? Well, here, uh, this number is the biggest, so we use that number sign, so it would be negative. And finally, we just subtract the numbers um, like normal without using the signs. And that will tell us the, um, the number part of our answer. 
So it's 376,043. All right. Addition of integers is pretty straightforward. Now we're going to go to subtraction of integers. Um, which is something that sort of confuses people to begin with, but there's an easy way to do it. So let's say we have um, 8 minus 6. Okay, well we know this is 2, just because it's um, like a normal type of addition problem we would see. But we're going to um, follow a different process for uh, subtracting integers than we'll show you here and allow you to subtract anything uh, by making it an addition problem. First we're going to take, um, our, our first number stays the same, we change it to addition, and we change the sign of the uh, second number, whoops, we change the sign of the second number, 